Triamcinolone Acetonide Cream Usage Guide Hello everyone! Today, we're going to discuss an important topic. How often should you apply Triamcinolone Acetonide Cream? This is a medication frequently prescribed to treat a variety of skin conditions, and it's crucial to use it correctly to see the best results and minimize potential side effects. What is Triamcinolone Acetonide Cream? Triamcinolone Acetonide Cream is a topical corticosteroid. It is typically used to reduce inflammation and relieve symptoms such as swelling, itching, and redness associated with various skin conditions including eczema, dermatitis, allergies, and rashes. How often should I apply it? The frequency of application for triamcinolone acetonide cream varies depending on the specific condition it's being used to treat. However, the general guidance is to apply the cream two to four times a day. But remember, this is just a general guideline. Your doctor's instructions may vary based on your individual case. Always follow your healthcare provider's advice regarding the frequency and duration of use. Do not use it more often than directed or for a longer duration than prescribed, as this can increase the risk of side effects. How to apply the cream? Before applying, clean and dry the affected area. Then, Apply a thin layer of the cream and gently rub it in until it is fully absorbed. Remember, this cream is for external use only. Avoid applying it to the face, near the eyes, or on open wounds unless explicitly instructed by your doctor. What if I miss a dose? If you miss a dose, apply it as soon as you remember. However, if it's close to the time for your next dose, skip the missed dose and return to your regular schedule. Avoid doubling up on doses to make up for a missed one. Remember, Triamcinolone Acetonide Cream is a potent medication, and it's essential to use it correctly to gain maximum benefits and prevent unwanted side effects. Follow your doctor's instructions carefully. If you have any concerns or questions, don't hesitate to discuss them with your healthcare provider. We hope this video has been helpful. Stay healthy, and see you next time.